Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. It is Tuesday. I switched back to my old glasses. <laughs> JB, JB, I'm recording. Anyway, so today is the day before our trip to Texas, and we're already packed. My husband is not packed. He's giving me anxiety. But I will say is that he's the type to already have, he, he's pretty good. He'll gather his stuff fairly quickly, but then he'll start asking me questions. Don't ask. I said I was gonna work on my patience. But my thing is, is that you've had all this time, you know, for months, we're going to Texas. Pack your stuff slowly, but surely. I say, at least, I'm a type of person, y'all, I pack like a week before. I'm not even playing because I have a list of things. So plus I get JP packed. Even before I had a child, I make sure I was packed a good four to five days before we leave. Um, I did get my nails done. Uh, last week. Look at this. Isn't this pretty? Can y'all even see okay. that? That's better. Well, I don't know why it was coming. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Like a melon color. And I switched to gel, you guys, because Miss Tina be I'm like, you need to hear just do it so we can go ahead and leave. All right, baby, we're going to go ahead and leave. All right, I'm going to show you guys how I make these peanut butter brownies. Now, I made these brownies a couple of weeks ago. They were so good that I, I, I gave them away immediately. And what I do, because I'm greedy, I put them in these cake pans and slice them up like cake. So let me show you guys. I have here one package of brownie mix. I add to that to make it taste like it's homemade. Let me just tell you what to do. I add it to that three tablespoons of cocoa powder, a sprinkle or two, like one tablespoon of pudding, and then I have two eggs and some oil. Follow the instructions in the back of the brownie mix for that. Now for the peanut butter I have here, about a cup of peanut butter, one tablespoon of brown, one tablespoon of brown sugar, excuse me. What I'm gonna do is mix this up, put in, you know, like a tablespoon here or there and sprawl it around. And then I'm going to mix in this peanut butter with some icing. I use fudge icing, okay, chocolate fudge. Um, and then ice my brownies. And then I'm gonna take it a step further. Well, let me back up. I'm going to ice my neighbor's brownies. Girl, it, it pays to live next to me. <laughs> I'm going to ice my neighbor's brownies. But for me and my husband, oh, yes. What I'm going to do is break them with the peanut butter. And then I'm going to put ice cream on top and then drizzle with this peanut butter fudge. And then I'm going to sprinkle with some nuts. I know, y'all. Doing the most. Doing the absolute most. gonna add my jalapenos this is half of a jalapeno half of a, a red bell pepper an entire green bell pepper um, a little bit of onion my husband doesn't really do onion and two tablespoons of minced garlic I put my pasta in this. I probably should have waited till it boiled. This is one tablespoon of chicken bouillon to some water. I'm gonna reserve some of this chicken broth because this is gonna help thicken up the pasta sauce. This is what my chicken looks like all good and done. You guys, basically I'm making a fettuccine uh, sauce, a fredo sauce, excuse me. I don't like that jar stuff. Make it yourself from scratch, it's really good. Now you want to cook this pasta almost done, al dente, al, al dente, whatever his name is. That's how you want to cook it. Now you guys, I make this dish different, different variations. You can add spinach, grape tomatoes, if you don't like bell peppers. Um, you can add mushrooms, you can do broccoli, you could do it meatless, you could add fish, you could add, I wouldn't do beef, you could add shrimp. Um, and so I'm gonna be basically making a fettuccine, a freddo sauce, excuse me, I keep saying fettuccine. A, a freddo sauce minus the flour. Typically with an freddo sauce, you start with butter, flour, to make your roux basically, add in your milk. I'm gonna be using a mixture of heavy cream and half and half. Um, and I'm gonna be adding just a little bit of Parmesan. You don't, you don't even have to add Parmesan to thicken it up. You can use cornstarch, but I'm gonna do a little bit of Parmesan, grate it, and shred it.
So I seasoned, it, seasoned the Alfredo sauce. And I went ahead and used all that heavy cream, you guys. If it gets too thick, I'll add a little bit of the chicken broth. But right now, it's okay. Adding my pasta clearly. All right, you guys, and this is done. I'm just gonna mix it. You see, I added a little bit more cheese. I'm gonna mix this up. You can use any type of pasta you want. You can use, this is good with both type pasta. Um, I hope that's not sticking to the bottom. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, just a little bit. I may add a little bit more cream, or maybe I'll add a little bit more milk. I mean, sorry, a little bit more um, chicken stock. You can use any type of pasta. I've done penne, bow tie pasta, um, corkscrew pasta. Fettuccine. I just have I'm just using what I had on hand, okay? And that is it. Mix this stuff really well. Make sure the cheese is all melted. Look at that. Look at that. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Oh child. We are supposed to be on the airplane right now. Let me sit down and feel y'all in on this BS. America Airlines is out of control. Um, our flight was canceled today and uh, a little bit perturbed. I mean, it was a very stressful ordeal. I'm looking at the flights and the seats are all over the place. There are no seats that are together. I'm like, what in the actual hell? So we're going back and forth. My husband and I going back and forth, going back and forth for about 45 minutes. And I was like, okay, at this point, we're gonna have to book this nine o'clock and you know get there at three you want to do that he's like we have another choice before y'all yeah, it, it was like drama just when i was about to submit that damn thing i get a notification from american american airlines that they have rebooked us for nine o'clock connection and el paso and then getting there at three i went ahead and accepted it accepted it now this is the bullshit that came across American Airlines now, you have to pay if you want a, uh, basically to select your seats. You have to pay money. Oh, girl. I'll say, okay, so paying for the seats. The original ones, the original flights, I had to pay for the seats. All three of us. So six times I had to pay. I think I paid an additional, like this is not exaggerating. I think I paid an additional between 80 to $100 just to choose our seats crazy so for this one even though they canceled it due to weather and it's like flash flood watch in dallas right now i have to pay to select their seats again i was i was pissed i didn't select my husband see i'm like you you just get the when we get there you will get your seat but jb make sure that jb sit next to me so an additional 75 dollars to select some seats <laughs> We're at the hotel. Come sit down over here. Come sit down. It tastes, it tastes just like the hotel. Yeah? It tastes like the hotel. I, time to order some room service. Time for somebody to take a nap. Wanna take a nap, boo boo? That was the quickest check check in I've ever seen. That was really quick. You can take a nap, baby. Uh, we're not going swimming tonight, baby. Baby, we're going to the graduation tonight. I don't know what makes you think you're running stuff in here. Come on, you better be a sweet. Oh, they put an extra bed in here? Yeah, this is his bed. This okay, is this is nice. Amazing. This is pretty. Oh, y'all, when I tell you I am tired, I am tired. We're at the hotel. Hold on, baby. Go stay on there. Y'all, this child. I didn't updo. I'll show y'all what it looks like in my dress when it's time to go. We are thirsty. We didn't. I don't know why, but we didn't pack any water. I bought a Gatorade. Oh my God. And I bought JBA apple juice. 
Water here is $4 a bottle. So I told my husband, we're gonna have to find some water before we go to the next hotel, which tomorrow we're gonna be in Urban. You guys, we ordered room service. We ordered way too much food, I think. JB has pancakes. Mm -hmm. I got it's quesadillas, tortilla it. soup. My husband got a chicken sandwich, fries, a huge salad. Mm. That's so good though, huh? Yeah. Oh my god. You play with him a lot. You play with him a lot. I'm yeah, going to wipe his makeup too. off. This thing is not even is it zooming in? It's dark in here. We ordered room service. Again. This time all dessert. Again. All dessert. <laughs> I got I got red um um I got red card. Yeah, I didn't even tell you. Ugh. Uh, I, this flight, these flights were were. And I, and I and and I got milk and cookies. The other um la um earlier. Oh yeah, they dropped off some milk and cookies and water. We spent four dollars a bottle on water and, just for them to have free water. Starbucks. Starbucks. Good morning, you guys. It's, uh, it's Friday. It's Friday, and I'm ready to sway. And then I'm playing a game. Jamie's playing a game. This is my first time. We're gonna go to a Starbucks that's right on the corner here. Look at my hair, y'all. I'm gonna try to wear my hair out today. Yes, I'm gonna take my hair in twists no. today, this morning. I don't know how it's gonna work. The back is still in twists. Can you see it? It's cute yeah. though. I'm gonna go to Starbucks. Yeah. Up this way, okay? Yeah. Come on, baby, where are you going? Oh, you wanna go this way? Let's go, let's go and do this way. The cast iron is right here. This is where we're gonna go for breakfast. Then we get the menu. This is where the, this is where we're gonna come for breakfast. Oh, this is the same thing. You still want cereal? or Do you want breakfast? I mean, do you want cereal. pancakes? Cereal. If you if you still want some more food, you can get something later on. All right, here's Starbucks. <laughs> you are going to be lost forever. <laughs> going up. What going the? Up. Why going up? Going up. What the? Don't do anything. Going up. Going up. What the heck? It's a haunted elevator. It's not a haunted elevator. I can we're, sit. We're, we're checking out and now we're going to Irving. Ned, we have a suitcase. And then we're not, and we're waiting for our Uber to come. We're not waiting for our Uber, child. We're waiting for our car. <laughs> No. Oh, ah! Ooh, I'm sleepy. We're gonna go to um, Ripley's Believe It or Not later on, and then to dinner, and then, then my best friend's gonna come over, and we're going to have some drinks, and that's it, we're done. Head northwest on Houston Street toward 12th Street, then turn left onto 12th Street. Oh my God. Is it Houston or Houston? Instead of looking at the form, right. you just automatically assume in your head. She's doing it in her head, not looking at the form. <laughs> oh. Is it shut down? Then? No, you see the roller coaster? Look, you see them on the roller coaster? Oh, it is so cool. You see them? It is so cool. 
Look at how they're going on the roller coaster. Well, it looks kind of Child, I feel like this is a twilight zone. It is twilight zone. Where is everybody? Where are the cars at? Is there something going on today to where they're not open? Let me check. Oh, there's cars. Well, it's open. That's just strange. I mean, it's early. That is strange. Early as well. It's early. Okay. So strange. I really don't remember going that back way like that. I felt like you could come over up right here. Who is that, JV? <laughs> Who's that? Who is, who is that with the tongue? <laughs> oh, they forgot he rides on Ravine. Oh no, 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 no! You wanna, you wanna take a picture with him, Boo Boo? They look really realistic. This is Beyonce. I don't know who this is. They look very real. That's that girl who uh, has nice gowns. And this is Mrs. D Donald Trump. His hair is fabulous. JB, we don't have, we don't, we're not doing that. We're gonna do the rippies, believe it or not. Was that scary? Yeah. Is that creepy or what? That's creepy. It goes the other way around. I've traveled to over 201 countries, and the strangest thing I've oh. seen is man. This includes you, my friend. <laughs> that is crazy. Which one do you want? Believe it or not. Ooh. Hello, friend. Yeah. This is. Oh, that. Something scared me. That skeleton. Look at this, baby. I'll open it. You ready? Yeah. You ready? <laughs> Look at that. Don't touch the screen, Jake. Don't touch the Human unicorn. Look at, the, look at this human unicorn. Look, JB. Look behind you. Look at that thing. Could you imagine being that tall? 811? Wow. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Please, one. Look, look. Look at your shadow. See? It's you. You see you? Now watch. Dance, Rubu. Dance. Dance, Shavy. <laughs> yep, yeah, this is the breakfast area that we'll have breakfast at. This is beautiful. You guys, we're in Las Colinas, Irvin. We're at the Hilton Garden. Oh, God. Can we go again? Our bar. Our bar. Ace. Yeah, this is a microwave. All right, baby. So you guys, this is our suite in Las Colinas. What is that? This is the living area, desk, sofa bed, TV. Oh, this is a suite? Yes, it's a suite. Um, is it talking about flooding? Oh, Lord. Next five days. Um, <clears throat> these snacks come with the room. Snacks. JB got a little bit of chocolate, tea, coffee. Hello. Microwave. <laughs> This is what I'm wearing. I told y'all would we'll be packing this shirt. Very comfortable. Same thing, different earrings. Yeah, the hair. This is the first time I've worn my hair down, and it's only half down. I know y'all really can't see me. Isn't that crazy? How do y'all do it out here? How? Oh my goodness. You on a saddle? Yeah. That's not a dip. <laughs> That's not a deer baby. No. 
elk is a um, it's wild game. Probably. It's it's yeah. It's very um. It's very gaming. Too brown. Too brown. Here's my flying back home outfit. You guys, we, this is where we used to live at, but it is, it's changed so much. Yeah, all that was empty. None of this stuff. Right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, my place is like shut down. Watch it. Look where you're going, baby. Watch where you're going. Poppy, poppy, softy, so. Poppy, softy, so. Yeah, we gotta go close over there. I think they're, I think they're kind of remaking. Well, we don't want to disrupt them yet, because now they have equipment and stuff. y'all can y'all see me have these transitions on my best friend and i uh hung out last night at the bar at the hotel and we got a little bit too lit every five minutes mama okay baby uh-huh okay i know that's okay i don't want to go over there so yeah i got a little headache yeah i got a little headache <laughs> um we're gonna go to where our very first apartment was at here in las Colinas. And then we're gonna head to the airport. That's long. We do. I remember that. Okay, Jamie. That deli is still there. The Donald's is still there. That's an old McDonald's to begin with. You're right. Mm -hmm. Boo boo. Andy. Look at these are our apartments. And we used to stay in. But they've changed them. Marbella. Mar Marabella oh, at Las Colinas is the same, the same the thing. Same. Yeah. The name was not changed. Yeah, all these trees and stuff. I don't remember all these trees. Do you? Yeah, all these were here. Mm. Yep. Then I will go grocery shopping up ahead and get my yeah, nails. A golf course up here? Yeah. Most of these are still the same. Because there's no there's no place to expand anyway. That's true. Houses are so big that they look like palaces. They look like palaces. Now they're getting smaller because we're getting into urban. Yeah, you know, that that was it. <laughs> there's, a, there's Italian that we walked in and we're like, uh, they run out back here. I used to get my nails done up here sometimes too. This quick trip is new. All that stuff is gone over here. Remember that um, some kind of Mexican restaurant over here? That vaguely, we went to? I vaguely remember that. Yeah, that right there where the gas station is, it's gone. Oh man. It's funny how some things stay. Albertson used to be in here. Yeah, it's gone. Albertson used to be on the other side over here. Their sign is not there, so it's gone. What did they put over there then? One of these. What is it? On there. A beach PJ's cafe, but it was huge. <sighs> Wisconsin, hurry up. Let me see. What? Oh, I see what they did. They completely. What the hell did they do? Their car wash is still here. No, the right car wash is still there. Mm hmm. I think about Texas. Texas people like to wash their own cars. Uh, so I see what they did. They broke it up into multiple places. Oh no, they made it into one of those hood bazaars. 
You know what? India Bazaar. Look, I have on a shirt up and off. We are back from our trip. Finally, we are back. We are back. Girl, I have to put on this. Is not. Ugh. Look, cover cover your ears, eighteen and under. My husband was looking looking at me like I was a whole papa dough platter. Cause all I had on was a tank and some panties, t-shirt and my panties. You know, I'm I'm at home. I have to take off all my clothes and get comfortable. And he's like, "Oh, I'm like, oh, let me let me find my birth control. Let me." <laughs> yeah, no, I'm crazy. So we are back. Um, we've been back for a while. We got in at noon. When I tell you, we are tired, baby. I am so tired and. Oh, the dogs, neighbor dogs. Um, we didn't have any groceries at home. So I know this is crazy, but I didn't even sit down. As soon as we got in, we got up, I Uber, got home. I took down my, took it out, threw down my luggage, went immediately to the grocery store and went shopping and got all the stuff that we needed for the next three or four days. Um, Cause my husband is off till Tuesday. I know I'm tired. And then I, I did all that and still forgot some stuff, but that's okay. I got the major stuff so I can run a queer cook in the morning to get the little bitty stuff, right? Um, got home, J JB has been fighting to go to bed. Y'all, JB, I don't know what it was on this trip. I don't know if he was just so excited and we were just, I think it was a multiple of things. He was extremely excited and we were over it just due to the cancellations and there was just other issues going on. Um, not, not major issues, but it wasn't a, a easy trip. You know what I mean? It was a very, one of those... This is one of those type of, this wasn't a vacation. It wasn't, this was something that we had to, you know, we had a purpose, there was a reason why we were going there. And you know, the only person I got to see was my best friend. So one of those trips where I need a vacation after it, cause I'm tired. Um, but anyway, JB was there really excited and we were, since we were over it and had little patience, he was driving us crazy, y'all. Like up until 20 minutes ago where he finally fell asleep so i think he was overtired because i know if we're tired i know my baby was tired so he's asleep it's a little after seven he's asleep um we ordered some pita jungle we already ate a little bit of that um i'm gonna eat me a little bit of this ice cream and lay it down but let me show y'all something i still had time find time to shop Oh yes, y'all, I found time to shop. So I'm going to a brunch at the end of this month. Charmer Charlie has, has a sale on $4.99, all earrings $4.99. So I purchased these. Can y'all see those? Aren't those pretty? Isn't that really pretty? My nails still look good, y'all. Look at those, aren't those pretty? So do you see what we are doing? The Miss, Miss Jackson has an eye, y'all. Yeah, I'm pretty good at matching up stuff. I don't have to bring it in, so look at that. Y'all, anyway, I'm gonna go make out with this um, jar of ice cream. <laughs> I'm tired. I got about 30 minutes and I think I'm gonna crash. So I will be back, I will be back to regular vlogging after this week, y'all. Take care, bye.